Hello and welcome. I'm Marco Morresi and I'm representing the DMR Association's Marketing Working Group. DMR is the acronym for Digital Mobile Radio and is a widely adopted digital two-way radio system in active use in over 100 countries. DMR does not identify any product but represents, like GSM or UMTS, a telecommunication standard for professional mobile radio voice and data communications. DMR is an open standard adopted by major manufacturers. In contrast with proprietary technology solutions that bind customers to a single supplier, DMR is a genuine, interoperable, and multi-vendor solution. Certified interoperable DMR equipment, regardless of the manufacturer, is truly interoperable allowing for healthy competition in the market that results in continuous product innovation. The DMR standard was developed by the European Telecommunications Standards Institute, a not-for-profit organization Etsy produces globally applicable standards for information and communications technologies, including fixed, mobile, radio, converged, broadcast, and internet technologies. The main purpose of the DMR standard was to define a series of open interfaces, as well as services and facilities, in sufficient detail to enable independent manufacturers to develop infrastructure and terminal products that would fully interoperate and is a response to the demands of government and industry worldwide for affordable, low-complexity digital alternative for direct digital replacement of existing legacy analog systems. DMR's main features include reliable and immediate individual, group, and broadcast calls, as well as mobile data services and applications. DMR is designed to operate within the existing 12.5 kHz channel spacing used in licensed LAN mobile frequency bands globally and delivers a spectrum efficiency of 6.25 kHz per channel. The primary goal is to specify affordable digital systems with low complexity. DMR provides voice, data and other supplementary services. Today, products designed to its specifications are sold in all regions of the world. There are three tiers in the DMR standards. Although in practice, commercial applications is today focused on the Tier 2 and Tier 3 license categories. DMR Tier 1 provides for consumer applications and low-power commercial applications licensed conventional. DMR Tier 2 covers licensed conventional radio system, mobiles and hand portables, and is targeted at users who need spectral efficiency, advanced voice features, and integrated IP data services in licensed bands for high-power communications. DMR Tier 3 covers trunking operation in the frequency bands 66 to 960 MHz, supports voice and short messaging handling, as well as packet data services. Now let's take a look at the following animation. One of the principal benefits of DMR is that it enables a single 12.5 kHz channel to support two simultaneous and independent calls, achieved using TDMA under the DMR standard. Time Division Multiple Axis retains the 12.5 kHz channel width and divides it into two alternating time slots, A and B, where each time slot acts as a separate communications path. It also may be important for license holders to keep hold of existing licenses to ensure backwards compatibility with their own legacy radios or with an external organization's analog system, for example, an on-site contractor. As DMR uses 12.5 kHz channels, the required spectrum compatibility is built in. Another advantage of the DMR TDMA approach is that you get two communications channels with one repeater, one antenna, and a simple duplexer. Compared to FDMA solutions, two-slot TDMA allows you to achieve 6.25 kHz efficiency while minimizing investments in repeaters and combining equipment. DMR Digital Technology provides better noise rejection and preserves voice quality over a greater range than analog, especially at the farthest edges of the transmission range. One of the reasons that DMR has an excellent range performance is that a great deal of effort was put into selecting forward error correction and cyclic redundancy check coders when developing the standard. These coders enable receiving radios to detect and automatically correct transmission errors by analyzing bits inserted into messages that enable the receiving radio to tell if there is an error. The DMR Association is a global organization 
focused on helping to make DMR the most widely supported 21st century digital radio standard for the business world. The DMR Association is open to any organization or individual interested in using or building DMR products or in supporting the DMR standard in other ways. The association maintains links with regulators, trade bodies and standards organizations around the world. The purpose of the DMR Association is to help grow the DMR market by removing barriers to interoperability and supporting innovation and adoption of the standard via the creation of new devices and services. Association members plan to accomplish this by creating an interoperability testing and certification program, working with regulators to develop a favorable environment for DMR networks to flourish, and increasing awareness about the DMR standard through education, promotion, and discussion. From all of us at the DMR Association, thank you for watching.